Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here and in this video, we'll talk about the MIUI 11 update for the Redmi Note 8 Pro. So Redmi Note 8 Pro was announced a few months back and this device came with Android 9.0 and the MIUI 10 update. Now a MIUI 11 was announced along with uh, the launch of the Redmi Note 8 Pro and uh, the, the schedule for uh, the MIUI 11 update was uh, uh, mentioned as December 2019 and uh, now Xiaomi has released uh, the MIUI 11 update for the Redmi Note 8 Pro. So the official update has been just released. It may not be available for all the devices right now but it is coming to all the devices in the next uh, few days. Uh, you can download the update right now. You can manually update it in case you not got it. So we'll share the link in the description of this video in case you plan to update it manually from uh, MIUI 10 to 11. So that option is also available. Uh, now, uh, if you are uh, already got the MIUI 11 update on other devices, uh, the Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 Pro also gets the MIUI 11 update. Now, here are some of the features uh, uh, of this UI. So first step, let's have a look at the UI. So the UI is now much uh, refined and uh, it's it's a clutter free UI. You can see that uh, the, uh, the UI has been much more simplified. And even if you look at the notification toggles, they are much more simplified UI. You can also see the icons uh, around the settings panel. It also feels much refreshing. This is definitely a great change from the MIUI 10. So you can also see the spacing has also been increased. So uh, it's not uh, uh, cluttered. It's a more refined UI on the MIUI 11. Now another important uh, feature which was announced uh, when MIUI uh, 11 was uh, announced is the Mi Share option. So when we did the video for the Redmi Note 8, uh, Mi Share was missing but uh, fortunately we have the Mi Share application in the Redmi Note 8 Pro. So if you go to the uh, connection and sharing, you can see the Mi Share option. So this allows you to uh, share files instantly with much higher speeds than the regular speeds. And this service is supported on all the Xiaomi phones, uh, Redmi phones, Oppo, Vivo and Realme phones. So other brands uh, will be uh, compatible soon. But as of now, you can share files, uh, large files. In fact, you can share large files instantly uh, with the Mi Share application. So this is one new feature in the connection and sharing settings. Now, if you go to the display settings, so here we have uh, uh, the dark mode. So we have seen a dark mode on uh, a lot of smartphones. So now uh, the Redmi Note 8 Pro also gets the dark mode. You can enable it here. But uh, uh, the dark mode is uh, more or less limited to the settings panel and also the uh, the cute toggle. So if you look at uh, Xiaomi's own application like security app, it is still uh, not dark mode. So that is something which uh, we feel Xiaomi should have implemented. So dark mode is just limited to the settings panel and uh, the notification cube toggles. So Xiaomi's own apps does not have uh, the dark mode as of now. So that's uh, another feature. Now, if you go to uh, the display, you can also turn off uh, the notch. Uh, you can see there is uh, a notch option with notch, without notch. And you can also, uh, without notch, uh, you can have the uh, status bar below and you can have the status bar on the top as well. So these options are available. This, uh, this is nothing new. I just uh, mentioned these options also available here. Next, there is an option for video wallpaper. So if you go to the gallery, now if you go to the gallery, we'll just select a video from here. So this is the video. Now if you select these three icons, uh, three dots at the bottom, you can say set video wallpaper. So you can see that now I'm selecting this uh, video as the wallpaper. You can also enable the sound for the video. So uh, this is kind of a really useful feature, especially if you want uh, a lot of customization. But remember that uh, this, this will uh, have uh, an impact on the battery because uh, this will take up additional battery. So if you are a person who wants the best battery life, then better don't turn on this feature. But if you are a person who likes a lot of customization, this feature is definitely useful. So this is the video wallpaper option. Now, next, if you look at the file manager, so let's just go to the file manager and the file manager is uh, now you can uh, see that dark mode is now available in the file manager as well. So uh, this is something which has been updated. Now, if you go to the docs, uh, you can see that uh, you can actually uh, read uh, PDF, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and all these documents without having to install a third party application because uh, Xiaomi has integrated the viewer. Uh, inside the MIUI 11 update. So that means uh, WPS Office is included. That means any uh, document files, maybe PDF, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, uh, all those things can be viewed uh, uh, with the default file manager. So that's something which is uh, really useful, especially if you are uh, dealing with a lot of Word files on your smartphone, then this is something very useful. Now let's uh, open the notes application. So notes application has uh, this new tasks option. So if you are a person who uses a uh, 
task manager to schedule your task so this is something which is quite useful you, you don't have to use the third party application you can create your, your own task now there is also option to create a voice uh, task as well so this is something which is uh, quite useful as well so this is the new task integrated with the notes application then you also get the new calculator so we'll just open the calculator app so there you go tools uh, you have this calculator so this is the new calculator and you have this option to uh, make it uh, available on top of any window that means it's a floating window you can see that it's a floating window and you can keep it on top of any application so what it does is if you're copying some uh, uh, data from or numbers from other files or uh, other app this is particularly useful you don't have to uh, move back uh, from uh, the calculator app so that uh, you don't make any mistakes so this one uh, really new option and in finance you can uh, see that there is option for gst calculation and uh, you also get uh, options like uh, uh, personal loan emi calculator so these things are included uh, in this new ui so these are some options so you can uh, calculate the emi then uh, you also get the dynamic sounds uh, which we have seen on other MIUI smartphones as well. So dynamic sounds uh, based on the day and time uh, uh, you get uh, the sound notification changes. So dynamic sounds are by default enabled here. Now if you go to the settings panel uh, you also have some additional options. These, are, these may not be really new features but if you see the special features uh, you get this uh, quick reply option. So uh, for WhatsApp or WeChat, you have this uh, quick reply. You don't have to open the app. You can quickly reply from there. And uh, available apps, uh, you can see this is available apps. Uh, for example, if you're watching a movie on Netflix, you can do the uh, quick reply option. So there is also game turbo mode, uh, wherein uh, you have this game booster, which uh, gets you really great uh, gaming experience uh, with uh, games like PUBG. So that option is also included here. So these are some of the features uh, in the MIUI 11 for Redmi Note 8 Pro. So this uh, OT update uh, will be rolled out in the coming days. So in case uh, you want the update uh, and if you are on the MIUI 10 version, uh, you can go to the link in the description. You can update from 10 to 11 uh, using that update. That's around 602 MB in size. So that will share that in the link uh, in the description of this video. So that's it for this video. This is Normal signing off. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.